Maryland Colony was founded to be a home for Catholics. Cecil Calvert received a charter to found the colony. On March 25, 1624, the first settlers arrived aboard two ships. The settlers founded St. Mary's City. To ensure that Catholics were protected, the state legislature passed the Maryland Toleration Act that guaranteed freedom of religion for all Christians. In 1689, the Puritans who lived in Maryland revolted against the proprietary government, claiming it was unfairly favoring Catholics. They defeated the government and outlawed Catholicism. The new government was not popular and was replaced by a royal government. Maryland and Pennsylvania disputed their mutual border, and so they hired the surveyors Mason and Dixon. They created the famous Mason-Dixon line, delineating the border between the two colonies. On April 28, 1788, Maryland became the seventh state to ratify the Constitution. In 1791, Maryland ceded land along the Potomac for the building of Washington, D.C. During the War of 1812, two important battles were fought in Maryland. The first, the Americans lost to the British, the Battle of Blandensburg, while the second, which became immortalized in the Star-Spangled Banner, the unsuccessful British bombardment of Fort McHenry. In 1828, work was begun on the first railroad, the Baltimore and Ohio. In 1844, the first telegraph linked Washington and Baltimore. In 1845, the U.S. Naval Academy, then called the Naval School, opened at Annapolis. On April 19, 1861, 16 people died on the streets of Baltimore when Southern sympathizers attacked the 6th Massachusetts Regiment en route to Washington. On September 16, 1862, the bloodiest day in U.S. history, occurred by the Antium Creek in the battle by that name.